Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to Marathon Mondays with Mal. My man Eric Benjamin watching. Hey, what's going on? I'm behind the camera today and in front, obviously. But anyway, it's a beautiful morning here at the mothership here in Coburg. Afternoon, rather, for my man Eric. I see that. Just, I love looking at these new shells that come in. This is one of the things about Marathon. We're going to get into a walkthrough of the whole facility. My man Pat Oberg, Marathon owner there, checking in. Good to hear from you, Pat. Let me know where you guys are watching from. If you've got questions, I'm looking at your uh, questions today, so I'll be able to take the ones that I want to and the ones that I don't. Well, hey, I, I dig on you guys, too. My man Richard Lawrence, how are you? Anyway, look at all these shells over here. I just love doing this. Uh, every, every Monday morning I get to hang out with you guys and then of course my, my friends on YouTube. Very, very cool. That's Coach 1390 right there. That is the latest. Oh, Pat, you're in Iowa, okay. Uh, that's the latest to be delivered. Look at that uh, right behind me. A new X3. Very cool. I'm going to flip it around so you're not looking at me, but I am uh, here at the mothership today and headed over to Pacific Shores Luxury RV Resort in Newport, Oregon. Uh, what a beautiful spot to be in this week with a brand new marathon. So I will be bringing you marathon coach number 1372 from Pacific Shores down in Newport. It is owner's week at Pacific Shores. So uh, as part of our uh, commitment to uh, taking care of the parks where our owners are. One of the things I'm going to be doing is I'll be there all week showing everybody what's going on at Pacific Shores. We're going to flip this guy around. Take a look at that, you guys. What a cool coach. Dave Bash is doing a PDI right now on this one. A lot of people say that's a Seattle Seahawk paint job. But stick with us. We're going to walk through the facility and see what kind of morning it's going here at Marathon as this coach moves from blue to white on this side. How cool. And there's Dave doing his PDI work right there. Hey, Dave. Dave's going on vacation, I think, here in a few days. How are you? Good. So uh, snuck up on me, I you? snuck up on you. Yeah. How are you this morning? Good. Good. I'm busy. I'm doing a PDI on this coach. Yep. All right. So I, I I dig this paint job. I really like this coach. It's got a real nautical feel to the inside. Uh, this is a new consignment that's already got a pending deal on it. Yep. So uh, a big congratulations to our youngest of the sales crew, Ryan. Uh, we met him on camera about a month or so ago, but uh, Ryan Dranga, congratulations to him, our, our latest sales guy who uh, already not only brought in this on consignment, but got a deal on it. Yep. That's great. All right, Dave, we'll have a good one, and I hear you're going on vacation. Yeah, I'm back to see my son. Going back to see your son. We'll have fun with it, and you, okay. a well-deserved vacation. Okay. Thanks, Dave. Bye, everybody. See ya. the co-host of uh, Marathon Mondays with Mal. Dave Bash, going on vacation. All right, stick with us. We are gonna be, I see Tom's watching. We're gonna be heading in here and go inside, take a look at what's going on on the production floor like I mentioned. The largest and busiest luxury RV converter of the Prevo chassis. That's why I wanted to show you those shells or chassis at the beginning of the show because we are building them. And our production floor is busy. Jared is watching from Portland, my hometown. Look at this, how beautiful is this, you guys? Oh, what a shot, look at that. Look at that color. We're gonna do this one more time so you can see that color. 
you got the natural light coming in. I'll try to stay out of the shot as much as possible, but look how beautiful this paint is. With the Chrome Prevo letters on the front of the coach, isn't that beautiful? It's something else. Right there, quad slide shell. We saw this actually last week when my son Brenner was hanging out with us. This is 1386. Always cool to see a, a quad slide shell. And this one, you guys, is going to be headed into paint within the week. And this is one of those coaches that we're going to follow all the way through production. How about that Volvo power plant on the back side? Okay, Pat Oberg just asked a really good question. And just so you know, uh, Pat, big thanks to you for asking this question. Uh, Pat is a marathon owner. And so he asks about Starlink. Star, the Starlink system is definitely something we are doing, not only from production, but also, this is a cool paint job, you guys. Take a look at this. Isn't that a beautiful color? This is Coach 1381. Okay, back to Starlink. Yes. Marathon is fitting Starlink. There's 1376 as we roll over to 1378. We're going to take a quick walk into 1378. We're going to talk about beautiful paint. Uh, Jared says, Andrew Steele gave me a shout out. Yes, uh, big shout out to Andrew Steele and his channel uh, doing good things in the RV industry. He's... Uh, he is someone that I've known for several years. Um, so a big shout out to Andrew Steele and his channel. Um, he shows a lot of, lot of coaches and he shows a lot of marathons. And I know he's got a really nice coach that he was profiling over the last week. So a big shout out from me to Andrew. Thank you for saying that. I think that was Jared who mentioned that. Okay, I know I'm going to get this information out. Starlink, not only are we retrofitting that system in pre-owned coaches through our service or post-production department, but also we are doing them on the production for custom coaches. And I will show you, this is a bunk coach. Oh, hey, Doug, I didn't even see you there, brother. <laughs> Bunk coach, you guys, 1378. Nice little check in. As you can see, the heated floors are down on the floor there. And they are laying the rest of the tile. Yeah, very cool. That's coach 1378. And from this side, you can see just how busy things are at the Marathon plant right now. I like being behind the camera every once in a while, you guys, because it gives me a chance to see your comments, see who's watching. Here's a good shot of the side. We showed this last week on my show where Brenner joined us, but it's always cool to check it out. Now, I'm going to give you a teaser before we walk towards the cabinet shop. I'm going to give you a teaser. into what I'm gonna show you down at Pacific Shores. How beautiful is this? If you don't follow me on the Marathon Mondays with Mal page on Facebook, go and like that page. I throw some content and I can see Santara in there putting the decor in. This is Coach 1372. 
Oh my goodness, the kids are watching. I see that. My wife and kids are watching. I love you guys. What a beautiful coach, right? This one will be down at Pacific Shores, uh, and we are going to be down there Tuesday. I'll probably be down there Tuesday or Wednesday through the weekend. It's going to be a really fun week. There's a ton of things to do. Everything from an open house with this coach right here. I'm not going to show you the inside because I want to save it for what's going on down at Pacific Shores. But all the way to, um, quite frankly, we're going to be there all week long. There's all kinds of events, including uh, the Diesel Pushers Band, which is uh, heavily. There's there's Mark right there, who's part of the Diesel Pushers. Are you excited? Are you excited for the Diesel Pushers show? I am. I am looking forward to this. I've been looking forward to this for a month. Awesome. So Pacific Shores RV Resort down in Newport. You will be there. And we will be live from uh, the, the show that you guys are going to do that night. So. Good, good. Thank you. It'll be uh, fun. Awesome. Thank you. So that's Mark from our cabinet shop. He's part of that band that uh, Jim Cogley is also in. And uh, marathon owner Phil McCracken, amongst many other guys that uh, come together and play several gigs a year, not just uh, locally here in Oregon, but all the way down into California. The laminate shop, a real busy area. It takes a big staff. To build these beautiful coaches. And also to service them as we head into the service department. Lots of remodels going on right now. There's 1192. And we're going to walk into paint. Yeah, Jared brings up a good point. Uh, Marathon's Fit and Finish is uh, second to none in the industry. That's uh, one of the things that we're really known for. There's Coach 1122 in here. Let's see the front of 1122. There's Pete Sutton working there he is right there, the head of marketing. And also, you see all those paint panels? That's kind of a cool visual for you right there. Uh, Pete just got done with his staff tearing down the Christmas, uh, the Christmas um, calendar shoot. And that is a, a video that we will be bringing you closer to Christmas time. But how about this? Here's a little sneak peek. We're not going to show you the whole thing, but that is the matching trailer to 1366. All right, still down here in the paint department. We're going to walk right through here. Marathon Coach in Coburg has four 60 foot paint booths. One of the biggest blessings of working for this company is that we have all the resources in one building. Look at that. Just take a second to look at this beautiful texture in you guys. What a beautiful coach. Boy, I'll be excited to see that one when it comes out. 
and then right into 1383. Talk about a beautiful coach. This is going to be really a good one to see outside also. I have seen it outside. You're seeing it, of course, down in the paint department. Thirteen eighty three, and then from the paint department. We are going to walk right through the cabinet shop, as you see right here. Smaller paint booth right here. Really nice to have all these resources in one building. I know I've said this many times on the Marathon Monday show, and it is break time here at the mothership. So you'll see a lot of people taking a break for the next 10, 15 minutes whether it be getting something to eat, taking a break, walking around the building, you know, checking their phones, stuff like that. Walking through the cabinet shop. If you are in the Oregon area, you should really take a tour of our facility. This is such a nice facility and I can't, uh, I can't state it enough. Having the resources all under one roof is a blessing for not just this company and the employees who get to work here and build these coaches, but for the owners, for the customers. If you're looking to buy a coach, if you're looking to get into a, a Prevo conversion, a bus conversion, there is nothing better than a marathon coach for so many different reasons but having three facilities and having an infrastructure like we have here, it's a big part of why someone would choose Marathon. 1380. This is a nice paint job too, 1382. I like these right here. See how the door is open and it extends right into these lines right over the headlights. And of course, this is the new H3. And as you can see, it's getting a, a nice cut and buff right here on the production floor. This is one thing that Marathon does quite well is after it's painted, we do a cut and buff. We've got two employees dedicated to just doing the cut and buff process on the production floor. Little racing team action right there for those of you who follow automotive racing. That's a beautiful paint job, my goodness. All right, you guys. I tell you what, we're gonna end it where we started it. We're gonna walk by the quality control finishing area. There's our flooring department over there on my left-hand side. Yeah, Eric says the red and white is his favorite. It is beautiful. And here we are back outside right off of Interstate 5, right about in the middle of the state of Oregon. Beautiful day, and I'm excited to get down to Pacific Shores and show everybody the latest from Marathon, Coach 1372, a brand new X3 that is still available for sale. My sister watching from Kennewick. Very, very cool. All right, you guys. All right, that's about it for today's show thank you so much for checking in and watching if you've got additional questions uh, malw at marathoncoach.com that is my email 
and we are going to be live down from Pacific, at Pacific Shores in Newport over the next week. I'm really excited to be bringing you that. And uh, we'll take a look at several different things down there, including 1372, the latest from Marathon. Don't forget to be yourself and do good things. I'm going to get out of here and, uh, yeah, take care of yourself.